Hello everyone, my name is Colby Cheese and welcome to Intercosmic Comics. <music> Greetings and salutations comic book fans and family, welcome back to the channel. Real quick question, did you guys get to see Deadpool and Wolverine this weekend? If so, let me know your favorite scene by leaving that in the comments down below. So something really cool I want to share with y'all, we have a WhatNot account. So if you guys ever want to come shopping with us here at the shop, you physically don't have to come see us. And one thing I'm always asked about here at the shop, if we're going to carry action figures, I would love to carry action figures and have a monthly supply of them, but it is incredibly expensive. And also you have to have these minimum monthly orders that are reoccurring. So for me, it's not very beneficial when comic books is my forte and passion. I love buying vintage Pokemon, and it has to be pre-2004 and minty mint. So not too long ago, I bought this huge collection that was multiple binders. Every single thing went straight into a sleeve to the binder mm, since mm, 2001. And this is just a small part of a recent collection that I've picked up. There's roughly a little over a thousand books here, but all of these books are either keys, meaning that they're first appearances, number ones, deaths, you know, some type of key moment. So not a bad little haul at all, but I still have to go through every single one of these and get them all rebagged and boarded. And with the price of bags and boards now, <laughs> you know, it can get expensive really fast. Also, I keep a little bit of Yu-Gi-Oh and current Pokemon just for our recurring customers that come in because you know you got to take care of them. Just a sneak peek for you guys. Don't judge me, but my back room mess. So we are at the point of the day now where I'm going to go outside and I'm going to take a break. Let's go do that. Y'all, I think my break room needs an air conditioner. 102 isn't fun. Now that I'm done hitting my vape, let's go do some work. about a coffee break? So today I am super stoked my Wyatt 6 shirt came in. I pre-ordered this the night of their debut. But what is super cool, Eric Rowan, Bray Wyatt. Now, it's like it's my hair out of there. Now it feels like it's complete. When it comes to collecting books, I love horror. Horror is one of my favorite, and this is Neil Adams' very first artwork for The Witching Hour. This is a super high grade. I love the artwork on this book. Yeah. Today, I tossed in a few cool books inside of our dollar bins. Check those out. There's some Star Wars, and there's some Avengers, and all these just stick right inside of these dollar bins so all you guys can be able to come in and enjoy them. Several weeks ago, I had this gentleman come in. He happens to be 83 years old. He served in World War II, but he was a huge wrestling fan, and he's seen my wrestling memorabilia, and instantaneously, we clicked. Long story short, he brought me some of these old classic wrestling magazines. One of my favorite ones, I like, I like the bloody stuff. That, that's the good stuff, getting the juice and the color, yeah. It's just so crazy that I happened to bond with an 83-year-old gentleman over something as simple as professional wrestling. Thursdays were closed. Also, I will be closed on Friday for something really cool. I've actually been getting this dragon worked on. I've only went for one session to go get the outline done, but this is Caraxes. This is Damon Targaryen's dragon. So yeah, if you guys want to see that video and a little bit of that, let me know with a thumbs up. 